Grocery Store Joe and Serena are going on their first one-on-one -on -one day and we have a sneak peek. Hey guys, and welcome back to another Shared News from Home. We've got all the details you need to know about Bachelor in Paradise, Joe and Serena. But before we get into it, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe to our channel so you never miss a video. Grocery Store Joe and Serena P are really hitting things off in Paradise. After Joe considered leaving the beach because of all the emotions that he felt from coming back to the beach, revisiting the Kendall breakup, Joe decided to give Paradise a try and take a chance on Serena P. Little did we know the two of them would actually hit things off. I feel like I genuinely came here wanting to leave with a relationship. I think the thing with me though is I'm only gonna leave with a relationship that I'm like all in 100%. So here we kind of have Serena saying that she is all in for a relationship, which is a little interesting because if you remember her on Matt James's season, she made it to hometown, she got to the final four, and she ended up deciding to leave on her terms. She told Matt that she wasn't ready to be in a relationship with him specifically. And Serena is a lot younger than Joe, and we talk about age a lot on this season in particular. There is about a 12 year age gap between Serena and Joe. But there's no denying Serena is really smitten by grocery store Joe, so much so that she even explored other options when she went on a date with Thomas. And she still knew after that date, after that makeout session with Thomas, that grocery store Joe was someone that she really liked and wanted to go all in on. So the fact that they're on this date now means they are 100% committed to each other. And now they have this private date to kind of explore each other and see if they are a fit and if they will make things work after paradise. So the reason I did stay is because I liked you and I thought there could be more. I am 100% all in on Serena. I mean, it's crazy to see Joe saying that he's ready to fall in love with Serena because two years ago when he was on the beach with Kendall, they fell in love and they made it all the way to the end of paradise, but ultimately decided to not get engaged. So is this different this time around? Is Joe really ready to get engaged? Um, there has been a couple times throughout this season where Joe kind of has compared Serena to Kendall. And I don't know if that's just because it's the last time he was on the beach, he was falling in love with Kendall, or maybe Serena reminds her of Kendall. We do know that in just a few weeks, Kendall will be showing up at the beach. So that's gonna be a whole nother situation. Right now, Joe is all in with Serena. And I do feel like they have a genuine connection but I am a little bit concerned that she is a lot younger than him and that she is from another country. And we know that that could be a serious complication, especially in the middle of a pandemic. You know, Katie and Blake are kind of dealing with a similar situation where he is not allowed to come to the USA for more than a certain amount of time. So if Joe and Serena truly fall in love and they make things work on the show, will they be able to make things work after the show, I think that will all determine on their connection and how much they truly fall in love in paradise. And we're just getting started on their love story. This was only their first one-on-one -on -one date. So you guys are gonna have to let me know what you think. Are you all in with Serena and Joe? Do you truly think they will fall in love with each other? What's gonna shake down when Kendall comes? Is that going to put a rift in their relationship? You guys are gonna to have to let me know because that is everything I have to share with you guys today. Before you guys go, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell because I'll be back with more Bachelor in Paradise news soon. As always, I'm your host, Zachary Reality. My social media handle is on the screen right now. So be sure to give me a follow and say hello. Thank you all so much for watching and we will catch you next time. See you later.